Tell me your car's clean without saying that your car is clean. Mom, mom, dad. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> fuck. Oh come on. Are you Donald Trump? Yes, I am. You know. And I'm Hillary Clinton. Shut up. Anyway, you want this bag of candy? It's so huge. Grandma. How old is it? Where'd you get that? It's yours. Hey, I haven't done anything wrong. You're always doing this to me, though. What are you doing? What are you re- Are you kidding me? Hold it. What? Drop it. I said drop it. Okay. Just don't shoot. Now keep it to me. Why? Hey, fine. All right. Did you learn anything from this? That you're always prepared? Wait, didn't someone say they had bird poop in them? Well, I got a microscope. Let's put it to the test. Collect our sample. And now we're just gonna melt some of it down. I got plaster wrap over my hands, so no cross-contamination. Sometimes science looks a little weird, but you gotta trust the process. I think that'll be enough. Now we just gotta load her up. I don't know if it's bird poop, but it's definitely something. Let's see if I can get it focused. Hey, Bobby, look, look. I'm American. I think I'll use my credit card. How much weight can you carry in Minecraft? Before the 1.16 update, the heaviest block in the game was the gold block, weighing in at 19,000 kilograms, or 43,000 pounds if you're a dirty American. We can fit 27 stacks of gold blocks into a shulker, and 37 shulkers into our inventory, plus gold armor to reach a total of 1.3 billion kilograms, or 3 billion pounds. That's as much as 144 Eiffel Towers, or 13,000 blue whales. And until recently, that was the most you could carry, but we can now go one better than that. Since we know that one block of gold has nine gold ingots in it, and that one netherite ingot has four gold ingots, we can use some sixth grade maths to figure out that a block of netherite weighs 77,000 kilograms. And by doing the same thing we did earlier, we find that Minecraft Steve can carry nearly 5 billion kilograms, or 11 billion pounds of weight. That's as much as 15 Empire State Buildings, or 1,200 elephants, and it almost weighs as much as your mother. What's the matter? What's the matter? What do you want? What do you want? 
Oh, that's not a ball. That, that's no, no, no. That's not a ball. Well, it is a ball. It looks like a ball, but it's a concrete ball. Come on. <laughs> oh my God, this chicken is amazing. But what, this is chicken, yeah? This is chicken? Can you believe we have had decades of men being told they can't wear dresses? You know what? Yeah. He's right. I don't need to be held down by gender stereotypes. I'm gonna do it! You know what? I was originally doing this for the meme. I thought it'd be pretty funny, you know? Oh, he looks great in a dress and I look shit, but um... I'm not gonna lie, guys. I mean, f I mean, bruh, bruh, bruh. What the fuck? Who the fuck is this? Who is this lady? Oh, what the fuck, mom? How do I be out here looking this fucking fly? Have you seen me right now? What the fuck? I am the boot. And the house is coming down, mother. Look how good. What the fuck? Hey guys, just found out today that I'm fucking adorable. So. Siri have trouble understanding your Midwest accent? Hey there, Siri. What's a guy gotta do to find Nightcrawler's Nash Wabanon? Dialing 911, you are having a stroke. No, no, no. Hey, Siri, find me some oat. Finding dope near you. Oh, crepe, Siri. I found a recipe for crepes. Okay, that's it. Hang on there, slugger. There's a solution. It's called Midwest Siri. Better known as Cheryl. Cheryl Lazinski. Oh, did you need me, dear? Hey, Cheryl. Oh, hi, hon. How are your folks doing? Tell them I says hi, won't ya? Download the new iOS update and let Cheryl do the rest. Hey, Cheryl, set my alarm for 7 a.m. I'm gonna make it 6.30 so you have time to stop and get some glazers from the quick trip. Good thinking, Cheryl. Unlike Siri, Cheryl doesn't rely on search engines. Instead, she uses family and friends. Hey, Cheryl, how do I get rid of a hangover? Let me get an expert on the horn real quick once. Charles, looking pretty hungover. Over there, guy. You're gonna need one beer, two eggs, some ranch, and like a lot of hot sauce. Hot sauce, huh? A lot of hot sauce. In some rain in a dusty black coat with a red right hand. I'm just trying to watch my stat lecture, and this happens in the first ten minutes. If you look at the X axis, what do you see? The dates are in order. Yeah, dates are not in order. Oh, I love you, Kermit. Hello. Let's see if I can connect these dots with the whirlpool effect. All right, starting out strong. Nice straight line, I see you. Uh oh. Discombobulated there, we're back on track. Oh wait. Oh no. Yo, what the hell are you doing, Leo? Get back on track. Yeah, it's not gonna look like a box anymore. I guess we're gonna have to see the final result. Here we go. Sheesh! Oh my god, look at Squidward! What was supposed to be a prank on a teacher instead backfired on the students. A blindfolded half court shot that is now the talk of campus and beyond. You I put that in the story too. You that. Are you kidding me? It went in. You know, I, I, it was did you see it? I'm yeah. Not you. Is that is that on tape? Yeah. That was perfect. You are I'm kidding going me. Like, no. I'm going like this. So I can get perfect. the goal in the background. It went I don't in. I know if I messed it up by my little screen, but oh my gosh. I'm gonna. This is good. Did that really go in? Yeah, it went in. It it's starting to freak in. me out.
And what a game here as Johnson kicks towards the goal and oh my god, Singh makes a fantastic save. But I believe he hit his nuts on the goalpost. He is down. Let us have a closer look at instant replay. Not only just self-sacrifice on this play, but sacrificing future generations as well. Obviously going all out for his team, saving the ball right here, but also losing two on the play, putting his balls on the line. Let us have a moment of silence for this man's fallen brothers. As you see right here, he got to the ball and so did the goalpost. Not only taking one for the team, he took two. Talk about going balls out for a play. With that being said, I would like to take this time to recommend you all to see the Nutcracker movie coming out this winter. Wow, this game is absolutely nuts.